What is up everyone? Andy Kruger here. Today's video, I'm going to put the finishing touches on my whistle recall command. Meaning, when I blow this whistle, I'm going to teach my dog to come and flip into the heel position no matter where he is, no matter what he's doing. And this is the first step. Before I get started, I'm going to tell you what I already have. I have a dog that comes when called. I clap my hands, I holler his name, I blow my whistle, he beelines right to me, I praise him, I feed him, I give him a toy. I already have that. Another thing I already have is a flip turn into heel. Did a video on that a while back, I'll put a link right there. It's good stuff. Now I can already hear the comments, oh Andy, my dog doesn't come when called, what do I do? Should I get a whistle? Well, you got a bigger problem on your hands than a YouTube video can solve. I hate to tell you that, but it's the truth. So sit back, relax, whistle recall, let's go. Okay, so first thing you need is a hand signal for your dog to flip into heel. Looks like this. Okay, so we got that. Now Mr. Whistle comes in. So again, guys, like I said in the beginning of the video, my dog already comes when called. If he's just running around. He knows whistle means come to me. He knows that means come to me. I just haven't put the finish on it. Sit front, in between the legs, flipping the heel. I like flipping the heel. So this little exercise is transferring this noise from running up to me and getting paid to running up to me, finishing, then getting paid. If your dog knows the hand signal, they know the flip finish, they know whistle means come to me, this should take two seconds. Couché. I can already hear the questions. What kind of treats are you using? What kind of treats are you using? No treats, no dessert training. This is his kibble, this is his breakfast. If your dog isn't motivated by their kibble, what have you done to that dog? Kibble only. Now you're probably wondering, Andy, why the heck are you rewarding him like that? Why is he spinning and going around the other side to your right hand? Hey people, you want me to spoon feed you all the answers for free? Do I come down to your job and ask for your services for no cost on YouTube? Come on, figure it out. 
Side note though, I will be breaking this whole session down extensively on my Patreon. So if you wanna pay your boy a little bit, I'll tell you exactly why I'm doing it. Easy, easy, easy. Get you a whistle, it's called a Fox 40. I know you're all gonna be asking that. Fox 40 whistle, get one, train it. Again, this is not a device for a dog that plays keep away and doesn't come when called, okay? This is for a trained dog that already has the necessary components in place. All right, y'all, there you have it. That wraps up another training video. I hope you guys like it. I hope you can use it for some inspiration with your own training. As I mentioned in the video, if you wanna see me fully break this down, if you wanna see all the behind the scenes training, the real training that I don't put out there for free, I'd love for you to check out my Patreon account, patreon.com slash Andy Kruger. I'm very active on there every single month. It's a subscription-based service, so you gotta pay your boy a little bit. You can't get everything for free, Patreon.com slash Andy Kruger. I appreciate y'all. Happy training.